Although Sarah Rafferty, star of Suits, and co-star Gabriel Macht, who portrayed Harvey Specter on the legal drama series, are real-life best friends, she has been married to Santa Cipolla for more than 20 years. When it comes to their private life, the two are quite discreet. They first became acquainted as Yale University students, when Cipolla studied finance while Rafferty sought an MFA in acting. After that, he continued his education at Pennsylvania's The Wharton School and spent 20 years working in financial management. Cipolla is currently employed in Los Angeles at the Angelino Group. In 2007 and 2012, Cipolla and Rafferty welcomed their first and second daughters, respectively. The actress claims that the family made a conscious decision to divide their time between Toronto and Los Angeles while filming Suits. When she moved to Toronto, where Suits is filmed, she moved as a unit and was always in the same location, she told Redbook in 2013. What's really important for us is that our home base is in LA. I was concerned about my five-year-old's attendance at two schools, but it turned out to be an incredible experience that helped her develop her self-esteem. She rejoices over it. Rafferty gave her husband credit for making their family work in the same interview. I have an amazing spouse, we're a team, she remarked. We kind of dance with each other while we work so that we can be there for our children. He works and I work. However, I believe that the entire concept of balance is false, instead, we simply accept the imbalance. Here is all the information you need to know about Santa Cipolla, Rafferty's life companion. Although Cipolla was born and reared in Finland, he currently resides in the United States with his family. He holds dual citizenship with the United States and Finland, and according to his profile at Angelino Group, he has resided in Sweden, Denmark, France, and Germany. When Cipolla, the eventual star of Suits, was an MFA acting student at Yale University, she first made the acquaintance of Rafferty. After dating for a number of years, they tied the knot in June 2001. Cipolla was an Ivy League champion and a member of the Yale varsity tennis team. He continued on from Yale to the Wharton School in Pennsylvania to obtain his MBA. On June 23, 2001, Rafferty and Cipolla exchanged vows, and in 2021 they commemorated 20 years of marriage. Two decades in, still mugging, was the caption the actress wrote on an Instagram snap she posted of the couple from their 2001 wedding. Santu, happy 20 years of marriage. I appreciate the poetry, coffee, and hope. Una Gray, Cipolla and Rafferty's eldest child, was born in 2007. In 2012, the family welcomed Iris Friday as a second daughter. Rafferty's posts on Instagram make it very evident that their daughters lead happy, carefree lives. She posted a cute picture of her daughter with butterfly wings in 2022 to commemorate Una's birthday, along with a poem by John O'Donohue in the caption. In closing, Rafferty wrote, I am incredibly, unbelievably thankful for you, Una. Many happy returns on your birthday. Dedicated to Mamarazzi, love. Rafferty posted more family portraits to Instagram in January 2023, this time to commemorate Iris' birthday. She mentioned in the comment that the images were put together by a fan account on Instagram, saying, thanks for making this walk down memory lane at Sarah Raffer Tippics. I'll tell the birthday girl I made it when I show her. The actress shared a video of herself and Iris creating a fairy palace in August 2023. She wrote, meet us at the Mojo Dojo Fairy House, bring all your magic, a reference to Barbie. With love, Sarah, Iris, and Cipolla's career and his wife's are very different. The Suits actress has been successful in show business for many years, but her spouse works for the Angelino Group as Vice President of Strategy and Business Development. He worked in investment management for 20 years before to joining the company in 2021. During those two decades, he held positions as a portfolio manager at Cantillon Capital Management in New York and as the founder and chief investment officer of Quito's Capital Management. He started his career as an investment banker at Salomon Brothers. Rafferty's Instagram feed makes it evident that she and Cipolla like taking trips together. She posted a picture of the couple from their 2005 trip to Bhutan in 2021 along with the message, Happy Birthday, Santu. I'm eager to resume my favorite activity, traveling the world with you. 
Come on, let's get involved once more. I appreciate you turning all of my logistically absurd ideas into reality. I apologize for not being there to burn you a cake. Rafferty posted a second image of the couple, this one taken in Turkey, in June 2023. The photo was tagged, hashtag FBF hashtag Istanbul 2004, by her. Santu, happy 22, one day late. Nothing makes me happier than traveling the world with you and watching our kid make fun of us on Instagram. How did she get hold of the 1990s pictures? Via the trunk of my granny. Despite her tendency to guard her private life closely, Rafferty appears to take pleasure in honoring Sapala's birthday on Instagram. No idea what's going on here, it was the 90s, she wrote in a 2022 post that included a 1990s photo of the couple on his special day. However, Santu, happy birthday. There will be many, many, many more birthdays and more of this excitement in the future. P.S. at Bronwyn Roberts, I see you. P.P.S. I believe that shirt is still mine.